What's up guys and welcome back to another video. I haven't done a, a sports video for a while so I just wanted to do one today. And it's called Let's Talk Sport with G-Man Episode 2 because I've done one before. What I want to chat today about is Super Rugby. Now in South Africa we're facing a situation where we have to get rid of two teams. What it's probably going to end up being is the Cheetahs and the Kings. Now, rightly so, as sad as it is, I think that is the right way to go um, because, you know, our top four brands of rugby are the Bulls, the Sharks, the Stormers and the Lions at this stage. If you asked me this two years ago, I would have said the Cheetahs for sure should be in there. But the Lions have now proved and shown that they're good enough and worthy to be in the Super Rugby deal and well deserved to. So, but the sad thing is, the Kings are playing probably the best rugby they've played in a long time. They've won a good couple games and proper games too, not just against the weakest. Um, they've, I mean, the Waratahs are Australia, one of Australia's best teams. They beat them. So, from that situation, then you think, now wait a minute. If they're going to get rid of three teams, surely it should be the bottom three, whoever they are. Australia are playing one of their worst game forms of rugby, I think, in many years, where I think the Brumbies are sitting at 18 or 19 points when nearly every New Zealand team's on in their 20s. So from that point of view, we should maybe they should look at another decision has been made, but I'm just giving my opinion. Three teams from the bottom. Sunwolves. I think it's the Cheetahs, could even be the Bulls or the Kings. Oh, Rebels, Rebels, Rebels. So those three teams should be going. Not two from South Africa and then one from Australia. Should be the three weakest teams. Because in order to make this competition strong, move it forward with the top. That's it, South African rugby on its own is in dire strait. It's really not up to standards. I mean, the All Black teams are phenomenal playing beautiful rugby at the moment. They are just strong, they are powerful, they are dominant, and they are a huge force to be reckoned with. So, SA Rugby needs to catch a wake up. They need to find ways to make our rugby better. They need to find coaching skills, they need to get the players right, the mentality right. Because at the end of the day, yes, a player could have the skill, but they need the right coach to lead them to, in order to succeed. Um, it's a problem with Alistair Goodsear. I don't think, uh, as a, I don't know if he's tough enough for this job of Springbok coach, um, and he hasn't proved himself at this stage. Um, they're giving him this year to to do something. Who knows? Maybe the guy could shock us, and we could play phenomenal rugby. But at this stage, I don't see that happening. Um, but who knows? Prove me wrong. Please prove me wrong. I want our rugby to be great again. I mean, when do you last remember the Bulls being so bad? I'm not a Bulls fan. Sharks all the way. But when do you remember that? It's not good. It's not healthy. Our top teams need to be in the top. They need to be fighting. They need to be up there with the All Blacks. And same goes for Australia. So it's just my opinion of where I see Super Rugby. Um, I don't see New Zealand going on their own, I don't agree with that, I know there's been comments. South Africa and New Zealand have this chemistry, when they play together they're always fighting and, all, sorry, playing good rugby. And I think it will be sad if they take that away. So I'll keep this format as it is, but what I would do is the three bottom teams must go, opposed to two South African teams and one Australian. If it's the worst, the worst must go. If it's three South Africans, they must go, they're the worst. But that's my opinion, guys, and I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, hit that thumbs up button. And if you want more sporting videos where I give my opinions on that, please let me know in the comments down below, and I'll keep them coming. Um, have a great day further. Stay safe and never give up. Cheers.